Hey guys, it's Tim here with Goat Reviews, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Ultra Pro One Touch Magnetic Card Holder. This is the 35 point card sized model. So before we crack into it, let's have a look at what it says. So it's made with ultra clear material with UV protection, so it'll keep your cards from fading. Diamond corners, magnetic closure. So as you'll see, it's got the magnet up the top here, but these used to be done with uh, screwdrivers. So it's got a no screwdriver symbol there. They used to be called screw down cases. We've got the frosted border as well, which just gives a little bit more contrast to the card that you put on the inside. So we're gonna crack this thing open and we're gonna have a look with a number of different card types to see what exactly fits in here. All right, so to open it, you've just got this little uh, nail slot here. So you just pull down on that and the piece can actually entirely separate, okay? So we'll tip out the card that's included and have a bit of a better look. So that's really, really clear. So the first card that we're going to try is a Yu-Gi-Oh card that is sleeved, okay? Now this is double sleeved, so I've got an inner sleeve and an outer seed sleeve. We're gonna see if the Ultra Pro One Touch can handle this size. So we put that in. It does appear to be the right size there. So let's give it a close. Yep, absolutely. That looks great. That's basically the perfect size for a, for a double sleeved Yu-Gi-Oh card. Okay, onto the next card. We have a unsleeved Pokemon card. So I've got a Rockets Moltres here and we'll try and see how that goes in here as well. So if I pop that in, I mean, it does look like it's got a little bit of clearance at the top and maybe a bit to the side, but, and there is a bit of a rattle, but for the most part, that will quite securely hold a unsleeved Pokemon card. Now, the same size as Pokemon cards are magic cards. So here I've got a sleeved magic card to test, okay? So this is the Thundering Raiju, and we'll see if it can fit that. So by the, by the look of it, no, it can't, okay? So with that sleeve on, you'll see it's actually a little bit too wide here. So if we try and close that, I mean, yeah, I guess it does close, but I probably wouldn't be happy with putting a sleeved Pokemon or magic card in a case like this. So that's probably a no from me. And the last card size we're gonna test is a unsleeved Yu-Gi-Oh card, which I've got here. I've got another copy of Blue Eyes with a different art. So let's chuck him in here, see how it goes. So generally Yu-Gi-Oh cards are a bit smaller than Pokemon, so I imagine there'd be a bit more clearance. Okay, so yeah, a bit of clearance at the top, quite substantial, and also at the left and right. So um, doesn't appear to be much rattle. It is actually quite solid, but yeah, there is there is a noticeable clearance on the top and sides. So it seems to me that the perfect fit is a double sleeved Yu-Gi-Oh card. That was what fit the best, uh, followed by the unsleeved uh, Pokemon card, of which an unsleeved Magic card would also do fine. An inner sleeve would add maybe a little bit more clearance to the edges and just make it fit a little bit more firmly. So who might like to buy the Ultra Pro One Touch 35 point? Well, if you're someone who has a particular single card that you'd like to put on display and it complies with the sleeving requirements that we've just been through, this is absolutely a great way to keep it on display. Thanks for watching and take care. Now for all my loyal viewers and subscribers, you guys are legends and I hope you like the video. I've left a link to the item for you below and I'd love to hear your thoughts. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next review.